is cold but your heart's colder I will wait for you The glitch in your eyes pulled me under But I will wait for you There's nothing left for me to do Than run and act myself a fool No point in trusting anyone So we're moving on to the next flight now and I'm actually pretty pissed right now and uh, I'm gonna tell you later but I'm never gonna fly with KLM or Delta ever again. Screw those guys. Okay, so what happened is I really need to upgrade my seat because of my back. Uh, for you guys who don't know, I have like a chronic uh, muscle pain thing going on in my back and in my chest and it hurts like freaking hell. The thing is I wanted to do an upgrade and they only have they have like economy and this is like comfort plus so at least i have like one upgrade anyways they have beds in front like the first class and i really wanted to pay for one of those but uh, apparently because i i talked to klm and delta on the phone like three times I've talked to the people at Orlando, I've googled, I've been obsessing about this for a week, making sure that I was gonna be able to do an upgrade. And apparently when I got to Amsterdam, because everyone said, oh you can do it in Amsterdam, apparently I can't, because Amsterdam and Schiphol is the only airport that doesn't allow you to pay for an upgrade. So you can only pay with miles. Like literally, I'm screaming at them to just take my freaking money and they just won't take it. They're probably gonna hand it out for, for free to some business guy. And that sucks. I just landed in Portland. I'm now waiting for the flight to Redmond and um, the flight got delayed by like two hours or something because there was a engine malfunction so we had to fix the engine. Anyways, I am alive so far. Customs here, they were so nice, so fast. Best like customs service I've ever experienced. So go Portland. I love you guys. Since the plane was delayed, I have almost no overlay, so I'm just gonna jump right onto the other plane and soon I will be in Redmond. I'm 
I'm going on a propeller plane. Yeah. Oh, Lord. Told you to walk away. That was my first and last mistake. I'm blue without your face. Well, what can I do? Cause I'm just a So welcome to my humble sweet Hi again. So I haven't been vlogging for the last couple of hours. I was picked up at the airport by Leslie and Joseph and then Leslie drove me to like a supermarket kind of and we bought all of this American <laughs> stuff. Uh, I had to get some tea and tea stuff, also some snacks, so it's like a uh, welcome to the US basket, I'm gonna show you what I got. And it's because, you know, when you have the jet lag, I'm probably gonna wake up in the middle of the night thinking that I need lunch or dinner or something. So I need to have stuff in my fridge so I won't like food panic in the middle of the night. And I'm gonna show you what I bought. After that, me, Leslie, Joseph, Lexi, and their two kids went to get some dinner. And now I am back at the hotel and my room and oh my God, they got me a suite, which is pretty freaking amazing. It is so pretty. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a tour for you. Here's like a little chill area. And here is the bedroom. Kind of do like this. So I have a television in here as well. And okay, I'm gonna show you later. But this view is so beautiful. And then I have this super cozy balcony out front. It is cold, but I'm probably gonna sit outside because it is just so cozy. There's me. And I'm gonna turn this light on as well. Okay, so here we have, here's one where I'm gonna put my suitcase and I'm gonna start unpacking now. And here's a sink. So it looks like this. And here's the bathroom. So I have two sinks. Here we have, yeah, oh. That fan is not quiet, but it works. So this is the shower. It looks very inviting. So I'm gonna take a shower later. Okay, I'm gonna turn that off. And then we have this little kitchen area with a microwave and the fridge. So we got a lot of water, of course. I got some like cream cheese and this is some kind of dip, like cheese dip. I figured like, because now I am in the States, I'm gonna go for the most American stuff I can find. And this is kind of like 
a super American thing. So I'm gonna use this for my chips. I got some milk and it's for my tea. And then I got some nuts, cashew nuts, a Kit Kat, some candy. I'm a sucker for sour things and I found these and these are some of my favorites. And then this. So it's like a European brand, so I couldn't resist because it's one of my favorite candy brands. And then I got just um, some regular crackers for the cream cheese. And I have honey for my tea. So I got some regular chips and also I got ah, Doritos because I love Doritos. Corn nuts and of course tea. So it's two different green teas. This looks like something with lemon. Yeah, okay, jasmine lemon. <laughs> and this is matcha. So what do you guys think? I mean, for me, this is amazing. I love this. It's like a small apartment, really. It's so big! I love it. I can actually show you something I got today. One other thing that I forgot to tell you. After, right after I got picked up at the airport, we actually got to the headquarters. So I got there, said hi to the staff and crew. Uh, we looked at the new spring colors and I have... I have... I think four colors in the new spring collection that's actually my request so I am so excited about that because they're so pretty you can't even imagine seriously how pretty they are you are gonna freak when you see the new colors yes okay so now I'm gonna show you what I got okay I'm gonna probably live in this one so it's a new traveling jacket for you know, uh, it's for the the trade show crew. I wanted a big one, so I, I got a large because I love it when they're big. And look at the logo. And then the logo in front looks like this. I love this. Oh my God, it's so cozy. Okay, I'm gonna walk around with this now, I think. It is so cozy. My God, this is cozy. Oh. We were at the headquarters and then we quickly just threw everything in here with the food and everything and then we had dinner and now i'm back home now i am going to unpack and then i'm gonna grab some tea because i need tea okay so it's 7 p.m here so what is that in swedish time it's like four in the morning my time well, anyways, I got to sleep seven hours on the long flight and two hours on the short one. So I must say that I was kind of rested when I got to Redmond, which is really good because now it is time to push it. I want to make sure that I can at least stay up until maybe 10 p.m. So I have three hours to push it. Uh, probably gonna watch something on Netflix on a computer. I'm so happy that I brought my computer this time. This is actually the first trip I've actually brought my computer. So I can use it. I'm gonna start editing vlogs. I'm gonna watch, you know, I can watch Netflix and series and stuff like that. But I must say I'm really tired. I wanna start unpacking now. I'm gonna grab my tea and get all cozy in my little suite. So I think I'm gonna end this vlog right here. I don't even know how this vlog is gonna turn out because it's been mostly, you know, traveling up and down in the air with airplanes. First day of the trip, I am finally here and I'm gonna continue vlogging from this trip, of course. I want to show you the headquarters and I want to introduce you to some of the people that are gonna be here. If you don't know this, it's a distributors meeting slash educator training. So we're gonna have educators and distributors here from all over the world and I am also gonna do classes with the educators. <laughs> Sorry, then I'm gonna do like my normal 
classes as well. So I'm gonna be here for 12 days. I'm so happy that they got me this little mini apartment because it's gonna be my home for 12 days. Don't forget to subscribe as usual. Please give it a thumbs up if you like the video. I will see you in the next vlog. Bye.